and really you and I both know failure is just a myth. Um, but Michael Jordan failed nine of his 16 seasons, I guess, if that's, if, if we're going to say there's got to be, if failure is really, and I just think, I, I love Thomas Edison says, I've never failed. I just had 10,000 ways that didn't work before I got to the right one. And We're here on Auburn's campus. Phenomenal day we got set up here talking to Coach Freeze, seeing practice. A little background for you on Auburn. First season, 1892, long time ago. Illustrious history. Three Heisman Trophy winners, including a guy, Cam Newton, probably heard of him. Bo Jackson, arguably one of the greatest athletes of all time. Gonna be an awesome day. Auburn Tigers, we're here, we're on the plains. Let's get after it. First stop of the day, got to go check out the new Waltos Performance Center, about a year old, and to show us the tour of the place, GM of player personnel, Will Redmond. So how we sit, you've got the offense on the right side, defense on the left. As soon as that meeting breaks, right above us, this wall actually drops down and divides. Oh, okay. It takes about two minutes, and, uh, and then you've got, and it's full soundproof, you can see how thick, truly thick the wall is. Uh, it goes full soundproof and you've got two meeting rooms for full units O and D. That is incredible. Located back here, social media, video production. Never in the history of football, especially at the collegiate level, have you ever needed these people more. Yes, right? yeah. And just being able to showcase individuals and team together, brand awareness, brand creation. These guys run with it. It's unbelievable. If you've ever seen any of our stuff on No, it's show, phenomenal, They man. do an unbelievable, unbelievable job. incredible job. You practice, if you're a fan, if you have a family member that's here, or have somebody who maybe doesn't want to be down field level, wants a little more relaxing place to be, you have this spot in this recruiting lounge uh, to come hang out, see practice if we're in the indoor from here, or be able to take in an away training session here in our weight room. Uh, I've been fortunate enough to be in a number of great places. I've never seen a facility like this as it pertains to a way you're not. And that, is that all? That's all new too. I mean, this is all part of this the entire game. building. Everything you see here just opened 13 months It's kind of cool too if you look up. Yeah, it's kind of this homage. It, similarly, in the walker room, they look like eagles. So war eagle. Ooh. Yeah. The, the devil's in the details, man. Pretty heavy. cool. Lap pool, sauna, Kids cryo, all of that leads from either outside, the indoor space that we came through, or the locker room. There is a car wash where you can walk through and it can wash all the impurities. Okay. Pellets from the indoor Goodness. Track. And then when you get in the tubs, it's not all That's a game changer. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Holy smokes, So you don't man. even have to break stride. Uh, this is the equipment room. Oh, okay, So obviously cool. a very nice, cool. very nice space. You can see kind of an homage to helmets, jerseys of old, right? Some of the great players that have played here yeah. across the top. But then back in this section, you also have uh, what, we, what is a, what's called a Falcon system. Okay. So that arm you see up, you have Falcon, shoot, there you go. This is part of our innovation lab. This is a full 360 body scanning uh, mechanism that will literally build out a map of your body structure. Oh, wow. For us then, from helmets to shoulder pads to cleats, feet molds, whatever you want to do, uh, customize for our guys. But this you've is got incredible. the armory in here. This is, yeah, this is the football spot. This is the football spot. Man. This is so cool. So all it the is air, it's ventilated, all yeah. The, you can hear it, all the air, all the circulation flowing through here, pumping air through the pads. This is... I mean, this is a one of one. This is probably my favorite space okay. in the building, uh, but this is what we call our huddle, huddle lounge or huddle locker room. Okay. You've got the barber shop located back here. We just missed him, it sounds like. Yeah. We just missed him. Do you, so you go get your haircut here too? I do will, you, not. will you come through here and have him have him cut Later you up? Too. Okay. Get your hair washed. You name it. What a game changer. That's so incredible. what's cool about incredible. this is. As they were building this facility, as they were talking through what are what things matter in a football building, everybody says, you know, you gotta have a player's lounge, you gotta have a player's lounge. Okay. Accurate, you do. The reality of it is, is especially everywhere I've, I've been, 
it's hardly ever used. Hmm. It's more used in recruiting. To yeah, 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 yeah. So what they did is this huddle lounge became the adaptation of the traditional locker room oh, smart. and the player's lounge. So on either side here, video game systems, uh, big TVs, pool tables, ping pong. You've got social streams here with Auburn football. Oh, cool. Fun facts and notes here. The SEC Network, ESPN, always rolling in here as well. But then you've got each individual player has their own locker as well uh, where they can take back. How's it going? That's unbelievable, man. Golly. What's, what's your best game, Will? Like, if you, if you had to win one thing on here, are you, are you not pool, terrible. ping pong? At uh, pool, okay. I'm not. Uh, there are a lot of people that are really, really good. I'm not one of those people. Okay. I'm not terrible. But you're holding your own in the power I can, rankings. I can, I can hold my own. That's so cool. And these are like... Yeah, take a seat, man. Golly, okay, I'm just, I'm getting to sit in all the thrones. This is incredible. Yeah. This is... Yeah, I mean, I'm sure during fall camp, guys are just like, man. this is prime nap. Material. And you throw a, a blanket in there. Oh man! You yeah, jacket, you're set. Your backpack in here. You've got uh, a lock box. Oh, it you can lock back. this in, and then you've got, um, of course, charging ports there, USB ports. And you can just and lean back, and you're just. You can kick back. Got, oh my bad! I'm trying to take it back forward. Oh, yeah. That's incredible. This really is. This is a spaceship. Ninety-two million. Dollars. The place was nothing short of absolutely elite. Next up, got to sit down with the head ball coach himself, Hugh Freeze. Well, we're here at Auburn with the man who's running the entire operation here, Coach Hugh Freeze. Coach, this is a palace. We walked in here. It's like it's like a hotel. I mean, how, how much of a game changer is this for y'all to have this kind of facility here to, to show to recruits yeah. and to have your guys in? Well, J.D., thanks for being here, number one. Uh, and number two, we are very blessed to have great facilities and but you you ask a question, and I'm I, my my word for 2024 is truth. It's like just 100 percent no half truths, no embellishments, no. We are blessed beyond measure at Auburn to have the play, the stuff we have. But when when I'm talking to recruits, like I was right before I come in here, the one thing I look everybody's gonna have some shiny things. Everybody. Everybody's going to have a nutrition center around every corner and more food than you can eat in this big weight room. And But the one thing that's different that I want to be different and is different, and I'm not saying that we're better or worse, or but everybody gets to decide, but the one thing that's different is the environment from place to place. Mm -hmm. And hopefully with the great facilities we have, we provide an environment that, that is attractive to some really good players that may be a little different than other places. Cam Coleman, one of our, I mean, our, our team at On3 does a phenomenal job evaluating and ranking these guys, and Cam Coleman is, it seems like, as good as there's been in recent history. How good can he be in your mind? Yeah, I've had some good ones. You know, I was Dante Moncrief to Mike Wallace, then to Laquan Treadwell, and then Quincy Attaboy, Joe Evan, Eagle, DK Metcalf, A.J. Brown, Van Jefferson, and... Uh, Boy, uh, I'm every bit as excited about him as I was those. Wow. I mean, he just this early on, too, even if he practices in, you're like, hey, he's got. Yeah, I thought he says something to him. And, you know, Lord willing, he stays healthy and everything, but he's playing, as, he's playing next year. You know? Saw the facility, got to talk to the head football coach, but we could not leave Auburn without checking out the iconic venue that is Tumor's Corner. We're at Magnolia Avenue and College Street, meet up, Tumor's Corner, Tumor's Drugs, right across the way from where we're sitting right now. And back in the day, I didn't know this, you would get a telegraph to find out if Auburn had won the game or not. So folks, here, okay, Auburn got the dub, grab toilet paper, and then paint this entire thing with some Charmin Ultra Soft. And so you can actually see in some of these spots, there is like some residue of toilet paper of places that they have just rolled from, I guess, the week before, the day before. What an operation though, man. This is so cool. So cool. This is like college football pageantry and tradition and uniqueness at its absolute peak, man. Right in what feels like the heart of the college town that Auburn is, man. Like it is second to none. Second to none. Tumor's drugs, man. A staple, not just in SEC football, but college football overall.
from the just quintessential college town in the SEC to the rocket ship facilities, Auburn, Alabama, the place to be. First stop on the spring tour, check it off. Put the bells at the buzzer too, baby, how about that? Auburn, we love you.